Umang itim. We have become a ritualistic nation. Ugut ingane ngane inelinga banenki nsiki chimie sangome. But have you been trained psychologically on, on even the configuration of your own mind? Ugut each and everything that you need to do, you need to take at least three steps and look back and say, okay, where am I going with this? And then the more you encounter problems, the, the more you, en you get more experience. And the more you have experience, you are ready for new uh, challenges. Instead of, we need to change the way we think as Africans. I always ask young people, Luguti, but have you tried at least 10 times before you think what you need nyanga for that or you need any mchandazi for that? In the olden days, I remember growing up experiencing when a woman is about to give birth and that was the spirituality of our people given by God to us. So what I'm trying to say, ladies and gentlemen, I'm so blessed to be in this place. I'm, I've never been this overwhelmed spiritually I, I, you know, the way 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 no way the way the way came here, they used to hear us saying, when a om kulu, om kulu, it means you were greater even to those who came before us, but because they could not understand. So these are the, are the terminological expansions that we need to make time and analyze and say, hey, let us change our terminology now. These are new terminologies that we need to come up with when worshiping God because another challenge is that uh, South Africans, they watch about you DJ, say like, come on somebody, and then we all dance and we do all these dance. And do you understand what you are doing? Because I'm Americans are inspired by something else. I'm so happy to be here. That being said, moving forward now, how can we make sure that our melodies do not suffer? Because music is the only natural remedy that can heal human being where it doesn't matter where they come from. The word ingoma is from a verb, ugoma. When we are preventing yourself from something, they say, ugoma. This is why those among Zobungoma, they use a song, baya ngoma. So, it, then, after a few minutes when they are dancing and beating these drums, you get healing because something was bothering you and they had to use song. And then when you go to an Ngoma, there is a, a, a forest called Ingome where they used to go and get a herb called Ingoma. So now linguistically, these are super segmental features imposed on a syllable Ingoma. Ingoma. Both these things can heal you by listening and by applying it. So it means when we teach our kids of their heritage, we need to attach logic. It should not be about what is funny in land and look for the panda, but say citizens push to see you. In the olden days, it's panda where Ugunen and Jobesa and Foy to my Varashil, where Pumas is Pagi Linga near Troy, a Begumnan de Gri, where I would call the Manjo soon, our Marsha. 
We need to explain these things because most of us are ashamed of practicing our culture because of the demonization that is caused by us. Umakfika belunge South Africa se kuba nama opportunities wangu muntu try to kuti to commodify even culture commodify ubungoma ubona umuntu hey I mean once you start saying hey kusho tunomoyo tingu klanza 